Hello everyone, Amazing Gamer here. Welcome back to another update video or whatever. And today I'm going to be showing you all the teasers for the uh, Five Nights at Freddy's construction, like, well, not construction sets, I just did construction sets. Uh, the 8 bit figure series or minifigure or minigame series by McFarlane Toys. Um, Five Nights at Freddy's. So, first we've got Plush Freddy, and this just looks very detailed. This is obviously FNAF 4. Uh, the second series. Um, yeah, this looks really canon to the game. Uh, when they're in the little bedroom in the the bottom left corner, it's really cool. Uh, they've got a little microphone right here. The hat looks nice. Uh, the bow tie is very well done. The, the nose. <laughs> um, yeah, the, the buttons are also very well done. So, good job, McFarlane. You did a great job with uh, Plush Freddy. Next up, we've got Plush Bonnie, which also looks very cool. With the, uh, I'm not sure what's up with uh, this leg and this leg, because one's bigger than the other, but I'm not going to question it, it's FNAF. Um, so here we've, yeah, the little buttons look good, just like uh, just like Freddy's. Uh, the bow tie is also good, the arms are a little bit weird, like the legs. Um, the eyes and the nose look good. Uh, the bunny ears are also very nice. Uh, no, this, this, the nose on Freddy and... Freddy and Bonnie weren't highlighted like a like a lighter brown or a lighter blue, but so what's nice bunny is a cute. And uh yeah, good job McFarlane. Next up we've got uh plush Chica, which also looks very nice. Her legs are very well done, her arms are nice, the bib doesn't really have anything purple or magenta on it. The cupcake is a nice touch, even though it doesn't have like little eyes on it. Still looks nice. Um Little tuft of hair at the top here. Uh, the beak is nice. I really like that. So, um, yeah, good job, McFarlane. Next up, we've got Plush Fredbear. He's here, he's there, he's everywhere. Who are you going to call? Psychic friend Fredbear. <laughs> I love that. It never gets old. Thank you, Matt Pat, for giving us this beautiful song. But, yeah, Plush Fredbear looks nice. Very canon to the game. The creepy smile. The big bow tie, the buttons, the legs, the arms, uh, just this creepy glowing eyes, and this big hat. It's just a big hat. How does it not fall off of his head? So yeah, good job on, uh, pardon me, psychic friend Fredbear McFarlane. Next up we've got Crying Child from FNAF 4, and he looks he looks so sad! I mean, you know, I know he's scared of the animatronics, but really... Dude, you're probably like ten years old. You you gotta you gotta bulk it up a little bit. The hair is nice, a little like tough of hair coming down. It's very cute and sad at the same time. He's the tears are very nice. Uh, the little stripes here, they're nice as well. The arms, it's like it's like I want to go home. I want to see my mommy. I want to see my mommy. So sad. All right, next we've got the bite. Oh God. This one looks terrifying, cause, but it also looks really good because you've got the little shade on Fredbear here. And you've also got like his arm is a bit darker here. Uh, the bow tie is nice, like look how it goes around and everything. How he has the child in his mouth is and the endoskeleton there. And how Fredbear doesn't even care. The ear, he just looks terrifying. He's like, oh, I'm going to kill you. Nom. Nom. I eat him. I ate them. <laughs> so, yeah, this looks nice. The ear is very nice as well. The the hat is very nice. Um, and if you manage to collect all six, you can build the bonus. Um, the bonus figure, the 8-bit figure, the brother. So that's cool. So it's basically the brother from FNAF 4 with the foxy hair that keeps scaring uh, the crying child. So, yeah. Um, I'm also... Um, I'm now going to um, let you all in on uh, some stuff that I hope McFarlane will make for the third series of the 8-bit figures. So first up, I hope that um, they will make Circus Baby, like the little Circus Baby figure, because, I mean, come, come on! I mean, after making this cute little thing, um, you just, you just got to do it. So I think that would be very nice. It 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 looks good enough to be a figure, doesn't it, guys? <sighs> Pardon me. 
Alright, so next, um, we got the little girl or pre baby or whatever. So, the, the bite victim. Um, yeah, I think she's good enough to be a figure as well. Like, she, she just looks so cute and adorable and innocent, doesn't she, guys? So, yeah, I think that would be nice. Next up, we got our good old pal, the freaking rainbow. Um, yeah, I think this would be nice to have as a minifigure. It'd be, like, I would really love that. <laughs> I'd love a little Chica's magic rainbow. It, it just looks so dominant and everything. I would, re I just really like that. And also, I would love to have a little Scott Cawthon, um, little Scott Cawthon, uh, eight-bit figure. That would be very cool to me. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I think that would just be really, really cool. Um, and also, I would really like Carl the Cupcake as a eight-bit figure instead of just a tiny little thing in, like, a tiny pink blob in Chica's hands. So that'd be cool. And also, I would love to have the Paper Pals as a few figures separately as well. But anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed um, my look at the upcoming Series 2 of the Five Nights at Freddy's 8-bit figures. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.